Hello, PCCS. Today is Wednesday, November 29th. This is Nick Brandon, Executive Director of Communications and Marketing, and you're tuned in to this week's LPT3 podcast. Thanks for listening. Let's get into this week's news. Here at PCCS, we are so proud to offer our students and their families a wide variety of learning opportunities that help each student find their very best success. For most families, that means taking advantage of our traditional in-person learning programs. But we know that not every student learns best in a traditional classroom setting. That's why we're proud to offer students a way to get a PCCS education virtually as part of our PCCS Virtual Academy program. The Virtual Academy offers elementary, middle, and high school programs with teachers readily available to meet with students and plentiful synchronous learning time to interact with classmates. Middle and high school students are also able to participate in after-school activities and athletics, ensuring that they receive the complete educational experience with PCCS. For more information about our award-winning Virtual Academy programs, visit the official Virtual Academy page at the PCCS website at pccsk12.com. There's an old adage that says that decisions are made by those who show up. Canton Township's Youth Advisory Council is asking young people to show up and make their voices heard by submitting input on programs and issues that affect youth for the council to consider. The council is made up of young people from ages 11 through 18 who live in Canton or attend PCCS. Students who are interested in submitting ideas to the council can scan a QR code that's available on the official district website and take a youth assessment survey. Responses can also be submitted by emailing chelsea.straub at cantonmi.gov. And finally, after we saw our first snow of the season this week, it's always a good time for a reminder about the PCCS winter weather policies. As always, the safety and security of our students and staff is our number one priority, and we make decisions on school closures in consultation with area meteorologists. These consultations may lead the district to close school the night before a snow day in the event of impending snow or in the morning in response to conditions that have developed overnight. Families will be notified of a closure in a variety of ways. Information will be posted on the district's official website, along with our social media outlets on Facebook, Instagram, and X. They will also appear on major media outlets in the Detroit area and via email. And of course, those famous PCCS robocalls. Families are encouraged to ensure that their contact information is current and fully up to date in the MyStar Parent Portal. This will make sure that you receive these important district updates on all of our outlets. And that'll do it for this week's news. Thanks for tuning in. And thank you so much for your continued support of Plymouth Camp Community Schools, where all students learn, prepare, and thrive. 